Faye made everyone happy by bringing back her Sarah Mama Palin impersonation. Mama Grizzly <laughs> And they're busting through, busting Clip. through that glass From Saturday ceiling. Night Live last night, Tina Fey portraying <laughs> Governor Sarah Palin. Now, just watch this because uh, I'm going to explain. I haven't seen anything like this in a while. Listen to this. Ultimately, what the bailout does is help those that are concerned about the health care. how much this book can change your life. Hello, my name is Elder Green. I would like to share with you this book of Jesus Christ. Hello, my name is Elder Young. Hello. Mormons believe that Elohim is their heavenly father and that he lives with his many goddess wives on a planet near a mysterious star called If you came to New York this summer Cold. to see a Broadway play or a musical, chances are the one show you couldn't get tickets for was the Book of Mormon. South Park creators Trey Parker and Matt Stone have confirmed to Entertainment Weekly that they will be taking their Broadway hit, The Book of Mormon, to the big screen. Today, Mormonism, God love it. It does take crazy to a whole new level. Black skin. This is the Mormon explanation for the Negro race. Months ago, if you had to bet on the success of a pending Broadway production, the one about Mormons by the potty mouth duo from South Park. 22% of voters unwilling to vote for a Mormon candidate. Is his faith going to be a big hurdle for him politically? Now, polls certainly show that it is. Most Christians would not recognize Mormonism as part of the Christian faith. That by voting for Romney, the influence of Romney, bringing people into the Mormon cult will lead people's souls to hell. hell. Mormonism is wrong. It is a heresy from the pen The Mormon Church was an officially racist organization while he was an adult. Forty-two percent of people say that they would feel somewhat or very uncomfortable with a Mormon president. about what my church views are because that's Why not? because that's not the nature of the office I'm running for and and there are people there are people in my church who are pro-choice that is not against my church's view to allow people to have their own position on politically Hello.